y'all just got to understand that. I'm not going to let nobody play on my top, and I'm not going to let nobody play with the Orisha, and, and, and I'm not going to let nobody play with the tradition like that. Because why? Fuck that. I'm a child of Eshu, and Eshu was sent to do the will of Alu Dumare, to make sure that his laws was being followed, to make sure all the other Rishas was doing what they were supposed to do. So it's in my nature to be checking shit. So when y'all see me come on here and I be checking shit, it's because I'm I'm a needed aspect of the universe as a child of Eshu that is here to check the nonsense. That's what I do. That's what I'm here for. So when you see me come on here and I rock with and I and I'm doing that and I'm rocking like that, understand. That's my father coming through me. That issue coming through me. Here he comes now, the big hand. <laughs> Bendiciones, Bendiciones family, man, yo, people crazy, man, people crazy in these streets, why, I don't understand why people don't know how to just leave well enough alone, why you don't know how to just leave well enough alone, ice is no wisdom, ice is wisdom, wisdom now i gotta come expose you on here now i gotta come expose you you see how that go see i was just gonna put that video up and just let it rock you know that that video that i just uploaded about isis wisdom spitting more myth misinformation about dory i was just gonna let that one rock and leave it there but since she wants to come and she wants to do subliminal posts and stuff like that and cryptic messages. Well, I'm not a good person to cryptic message. You might as well just, if you're going to address me, just put a whole addy on it because I'm the type that if, when I feel like somebody put a cryptic message, I'm going to just get at you because I don't, I'm not, I don't come from a fake ass world. I don't know none of that. I come from the sneak dissing that's that shit i don't like i come from i come from when a motherfucker want to address you they're going to say your name i don't understand all this old weird ass shit that motherfuckers be doing in this goddamn spiritual community okay and that's just how i get down so when you guys want to come and people want to put cryptic message and all this old stupid weird ass shit then guess what i'm gonna be at your door like what's popping okay so pretty much you know she goes on there she puts them and this is going to be a teachable moment because I, I have receipts on the on my claims that i'm making um to to back up what i'm saying okay and this is going to be a really eye-opening moment for these so-called spiritual conscious leaders okay y'all know what i'm talking about the spiritual conscious leaders. Yeah. So I'm going to, I'm going to post exactly what I mean because they all use the same tactics. They all use the same tactics. When you catch their hands in the cookie jar, they use the same tactics. It doesn't change. Huh? So let's get it started. So she, uh, you know, after that video that I posted, where I was exposing her for being a fake ass priest because she claimed that she was an Ifa priest, which if she was an Ifa priest, I mean, I thought that she would have used the word I and Ifa, but I don't know, whatever. Listen, she claiming to be Ifa priest, I, 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 and, and doesn't know anything what she's talking about, telling people, you know, to go just to the Orisha, 
without knowing shit that they're doing. You know, all this irresponsible, weird shit that she's doing. You know, which, you know, ISIS, I I got ammo, okay? So we can, you know, we can do the internet thing and you could just get um, further exposed during the internet. So, you know, you play that game, stupid games win stupid prizes. And, and I haven't seen anybody, you know, that doesn't take a hit after a back and forth with King Brujo. That's just for the record, okay? That's just for the record because I'll start pulling out information on your ass. So basically, she started uh, talking her shit. So she comes online and they try this method. I want y'all to pay attention to what she did here, okay? So after I put that, she goes, she pushed this up. And now she's the victim all of a sudden. Remember, she was talking that shit. My time, my essence, my energy cannot be wasted on anything that does not deserve unity consciousness. My people have wasted enough time on tearing each other down. If people spent more time on a healing path, people would be in a better state of mind. Pay attention to those spreading a message of division. If their words are not coming from a place of love, you got to cut that negative energy out because at the end of the day, it never hurts the folks who are on a mission. It only hurts you. The older you get, the more quiet you become. Life humbles you so deeply as you age. You realize how much nonsense you've wasted time on. And this is the running her mouth, this motherfucker that you will ever see on YouTube. Oh, frog mouth running her mouth ass motherfucker that come on YouTube and run her mouth about every goddamn thing. And this is the bullshit I'll be talking about, family. She's going to come on here. And now, remember what I told y'all, the number one method of deflection with these type of people is put it on black power or put it on white supremacy. Remember I told you that? The minute when you come questioning them with legit questions, the minute that you come forth with some legit concerns, what are they going to do? They're going to put it on consciousness oh y'all tearing each other down oh it's grabbing a bucket oh oh my god this is what they do this is what they do they come with that bullshit while in the background they stealing every motherfucking thing every motherfucking thing they stealing don't make me come show that part and that's why i said I'm about to start bringing the real priestesses on my channel because fuck that shit. And I said, y'all motherfuckers going to show me some love too. Listening, y'all going to show me some love too. So y'all need to be subscribing to my channel and sharing this content because why I'm bringing information that people pay a lot of money for, period. And y'all getting it for free on motherfucking YouTube, goddamn. So this lady, she coming on here talking about this old fake ass higher self shit. And, you know, with these people, they like to use these gaslighting words like you're in your lower sound. Low vibrational, low frequency people. Man, if you don't get the fuck out of here with that shit, nigga. That's what duality is about, okay? It's a time to be low vibrational. It's a time to be a uh, lower self. It's a time for it. Like right now, because of the disrespect of the tradition, it's the time for me to be so-called low frequency, which some people would not perceive it as being low frequency. Some people are gonna say that I am in my higher self because I'm doing it for a just cause. So, as you see, like I said, 
Look at what she does. Pay attention to those spreading a message of division. I don't know, you know, if people be tuned in, but this woman is always spreading division. I, you know what? I will go and, and I got the receipts, so it don't matter because it's going to be shown. But she always spreading some bullshit, man. She always spreading some bullshit. In the motherfucking video I played, talking about the situation, she was on there talking some dumb ass shit. In that video, she was. So, you know, she didn't, she didn't decide to leave it here. She didn't decide. Mind you, in the comments, she further um, kind of goes into things in the comment section. Okay. And, you know, she putting her, continuing to put her subliminal towards me and, uh, and um, you know, a couple other YouTubers. Because why? Motherfuckers is not beat for the nonsense. Nobody coming to play with your ass. ISIS wisdom. So let me pull up this receipt. Okay. And this is what she does. This is what she does. Okay. See? So now here she comes. This is all today. So she keep on coming, poking Bear. Okay, well, now Bear is here. What's up? She say, remember, remember this in spite of our differences, opinions, and judgments of each other. One thing that is constant is that love conquers all. Yes. Like I said, I love to come on here and expose fraudulent behavior i love to come on here and expose weird ass motherfuckers that's what i love to do goddamn when i come expose somebody i do it with love when i come give somebody spiritual hands i give them spiritual hands with love in my heart because that's what i love to do okay so i'm glad that she pointing this stuff out because now let Let's continue, shall we? Because when I posted that video, a couple people that were part of her program actually commented, wow, go figure. Let's see what they had to say. Uh, so on that, on that video, somebody commented, um, thank you. She tried to carry me on a telegram recording for asking what's the difference between Rashad and Nature Boy and to use discernment. Then she kicked me out of her telegram, LOL. This was just yesterday, LOL. Wow. This is, this is your, so, so ISIS, ISIS no wisdom, ISIS wisdom. Or were you in your higher self when you kicked this young lady out of your group because she asked you a question? Were you in your higher self when you did that? When you decided to deflect from the issue at hand and she asked you what was good, you put her out the group. Were you in high frequency when you did that? Were you high vibrational? All this weird ass terminology that y'all be using. That's why I stick to the traditional things. That's why I stick to tradition, family. Because this is what people come do. They can come manipulate this old other knowledge. Why? Because of where they heard it from. And that's from a whole nother video that I can get into that. So right now, we're going to stick on what the issue at hand is. Thank you. She tried to carry me on a telegram recording for asking what's the difference between Rashad and Nature Boy. Why you couldn't just answer that question? Is it a hard question to figure out the difference between Rashad, Jamal, and Nature Boy? Is this something we don't know? Eh? Because you know, that's, that's, that's your mans. That's her people's. So why, why you couldn't just answer that girl's question? Why you couldn't answer this woman's question? 
why it had to be a whole drama filled moment. Talk to me, family, because I don't, I don't understand. Talk to me. Why she couldn't answer this woman's question calmly. Why she couldn't answer this woman's question with grace. She had to just kick her out the telegram. Wow. These are spiritual leaders, yo. That, I'm not done. I'm not done. I'm not done. I'm not finished. Hold up. So here's another one. This person says, spot on analysis. I never understood why the same people who say that they are indigenous to America think they have access to African spiritual practices. That's true. If you an Aboriginal, you said that you are Aboriginal to America, then you need to deal with Aboriginal deities or Oshun and them. You know, that's not really your concern. Leave that to the people that had the blood there. You have deities from here, from America that you can call. If you don't know those deities, ah, maybe you should think about oh, if you really are so Aboriginal. Because if you are Aboriginal, the culture should survive through and through and you can see it in the food. You should be able to see it in the dance. You should be able to see it in the religion. You should be able to see it in the language. You should be able to see it in your mannerisms. If you don't see that, now you have to ask bigger questions. This maybe you just go get DNA tests and find the truth. Now, I digress from that because it's not about that right now. It's about ISIS no wisdom and her deflecting ass. So she says, it is a bloodline thing, not a race thing. I knew ISIS was a fraud when I questioned her on a girl who she said was being held in Jamaica and that her mom was killed over there. When it came out that the girl was lying and the mother is just fine, she acted like she wasn't just lying and stirring hate between Jamaicans and Americans. Look, causing division. Then she say, that's what I was doing, causing division. You see these people? Family, do you see how these people get down? Deceptive. You see how you, see how you, you pronounce deceptive? Deceptive some deceptive, deceiving people, huh? She said, she kicked me out the group when I posted evidence that what ISIS said was a lie. She is a fraud taking advantage of gullible people. Oh, oh, mind you, this is people that have left ISIS's group. This is people that were in her group. They were a part of her telegram. They were her followers. They were people that looked at her in high regard. And look at what they saying about this woman. Ah, can you believe it? Mira, mira esto, que esto gente está diciendo. Ah, mira esto. Que esta pasando, Isis? <laughs> Isis? Que esto, Isis? Que esto, viene para hablar, que esto, Isis? So ISIS was trying to make a war. She See, ISIS was on her Tariq Nasheed shit. She was trying to have uh, Black Americans beefing with Jamaicans and shit. Look at that. Wow. Wow. Look at that. ISIS, you got some explaining to do. This is crazy. And then when the girl asked the question and posted the evidence, instead of ISIS addressing Instead of ISIS addressing the situation, what she do? She just kicked her out. Is that family? Is that your higher self? I need to know. I need to know. I need to know more than Joe. I need to know. <laughs> I need to know, family. <laughs> I really do. Is that your higher self? Hmm? Is that the journey to your higher self? Okay. Now, I'm not done. See, 
people going to come out. with that. That's why I do what I do, because I give people a chance to ex express their self. Okay? Now, here we go. Here we go. Somebody else, a whole nother person. Y'all seeing the profiles. Look, finally, being called out on her BS. She's upset because people that actually have enough experience and are fully committed are putting her on the spot. Nobody likes to be embarrassed or questioned. She will delete comments like she did with mine on Telegram. Wow. So here we go with another person. A third. Three. Three. For the three. For the Steph Curry with the pop. For the three. For the three. For the three. Damn. This is crazy. She said, she um, if she's questioned, she would delete comments like she did with mine on Telegram. Like on the fact you've been moving funny, especially with her support of Rashad Jamal's case. How can someone speak so highly of spirituality and not speak up about the children and what? The children. The children, family, how can they not speak up about the children and not speak up about the children and want to mask it saying he's on a mission? <laughs> Yo. <laughs> she said, you on... she said Rashad Jamal is in jail on a mission. Oh, fuck it. He's on a mission to go to trial, nigga. She said, <laughs> Mask it saying he's on a mission and everything that's happening to him is an illusion. Disgusting. I agree, sister. Lovely, whoever your name is, I agree with what you're saying. For real. I really do. She said, You definitely broke a lot down. It's clear you're confident and knowledgeable of what you speak of. Meanwhile, Rashad speaking on this is all fidgety, scratching his head, thinking about what else to say as if he as if he rehearsed it. All of this is supposed to flow natural if you're about that life. That's true. Now, this is a person with common fucking sense. Shout out to the sister, lovely, for having common sense. And from her profile, it looks like a beautiful sister too, okay? Shout out to her for having common fucking sense. Um, Isis, what the fuck is going on? Why are you why are you kicking people out of your telegram for asking simple questions? We want to know. We the people want to know. We want to know. Okay? This is crazy. She said he's on a <laughs> She said he's on a mission and everything that's happening to him is an illusion. Look at how they do. Now, Tell me that ain't what Umar and them be doing the same shit. When people, when people come asking for school and they, oh, what's up with the school? What are he going to say? He going to say, he going to throw something in there that have to deal with white supremacy or black power and then try to make it like an illusion. Like if the school is there and the school is not there. This is what they all do. They come on here and they try to make illusion in your mind. What is that? This is the crazy shit about life. I don't understand it, but I do understand it. Because fraudulent behavior, fraudulent thoughts are going to beget fraudulent behavior, fraudulent practices. You see? This woman is clearly a fraud. Now you have your mentees. Basically, these are your mentees that are coming out and speaking on you and your character. These mentees were closer than all of us because they were in your telegram and they dealt with you on a regular basis. And so they were clearly able to see you for who you were. And that person is a fraud. See? You see? Now I gotta just expose it. Cause I'm tired of playing with people, man. Fuck that shit. We need to clean up the community. 
And when we clean up the community, then we can get ahead. But if we keep having people like ISIS, no wisdom, leading people down the wrong path. Oh, my God. Y'all got to think about the magnitude of this for real, for real. Like, actually think about the magnitude of what she's doing when she's leading people. She's leading people into destruction. She's leading them into certain life situations, okay? When you're going and you're telling these people uh, just to go to Oshun and not know anything that they're doing, uh, this is what I'm talking about. Disrespectful, totally disrespectful to tradition. That's not priestly. And are, it's dangerous. Are these, is this person a child of Oshun? Because are you even telling them, you know, that the Ebo that they're doing should have been recommended by Orumila? They're, they're not a child of that, Orisha. You don't know who they're the child of, but you're sending them to Orisha. Like the shit Rashad Jamal was talking about. You see? This is what I'm telling y'all. But, you know, that's another thing. We get into that when we dig deeper into the knowledge. You know, when we dig deeper into the knowledge, when uh, this love come through a little heavier, you know, and I open up that Rolodex of people. But um, it's deep. It's deep, family. So I just had to come on here and really expose that to the world because, wow, wow. You kicking people out your group because they asking questions? What is that? What is that? What is that? This is crazy. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. This is crazy. They be wilding, yo. They be wilding in these spiritual streets. Y'all got to watch them. Y'all got to watch them. Y'all got to watch them. So if you're new to my channel, subscribe subscribe to my channel you know go through the content i got different playlists you know the spiritual beef playlist or the knowledge the the lessons you know the one the the, the one where you go learn this and that you know whatever you come here to do i got it because why over here i believe in duality child of issue believe in duality okay so if you if you want to be entertained you know, it's entertainment on this channel, too. And if you want to learn, you can learn here, too. OK, this is just a place where that can happen at. But I just had to put this forth because ISIS No Wisdom is out of pocket. ISIS, sister, I'm going to tell you this. You need to heal. You like, see, look, now I got to start talking like them. You need to heal, sister. You need to heal those wounds that are preventing you from listening to other people's opinions. Yes, sister, you need to heal that hurt that's allowing you to react this way towards criticism. You see, because when you love yourself, no amount of criticism can crack you, okay? You see, when you love yourself, sister, no amount of criticism can crack you. And so I think that what you need to do is go, you know, meditate on some crystals under the moonlight and really find love, really find that place of love in your heart, wherever the fuck you at in Mexico or wherever that you ran from because you be scamming on the run. And wherever that is, you need to find peace. Okay. And that is my message to Isis Wisdom. Okay. Do some work on your root chakra. You need to, <laughs> you need to do some root chakra work, Queen. All right. Okay. And and you need to fix your sacral chakra. All right. Because what you did, it wasn't right. You shouldn't have kicked those people out of your group. Okay. Okay. 
Ah, <laughs> uh, so I get at y'all, fam. I shoot.